Well, well, boys, twin calipers. Let's show you how to do it. Right, so this is going to be the double calipers. Uh, I've got the other calipers over there, but first of all, we need to get this on. So I bought this from, I think it's from Canada or something like that. Um, so I thought it was quite cheap buying these, but I got nailed on stamp duty or whatever it is, tax when it was coming in the country. So these are not that cheap, but um, Callum thinks that you can just make these anyway so if anybody needs brackets and you're in the UK then uh, give me a message and see should be able to do these no bother um, so yeah this will go in here that there's a slight difference with the with the lugs so this is slightly longer than this side so you want the big lug to go to the top of the thingy and yeah it'll sit something like that I'm putting in the the foot uh, caliper onto the the new one, and I'm putting the Willwood onto here. So you just need to watch for the bolt spacing in here for coming out. But you know it'll sit roughly something like that. So you've got plenty of room. But I think you need to put this arm on first before you put either the calipers on because you can't get the bolt out this way. And then once you've got the caliper on here, you also can't get the bolt out. Maybe if you have two standard calipers then you'll be able to get the bolt out no bother but because i'm going the willwood uh, on here it's much bigger and it's, it comes out further so yeah that's not going to work so i need to put the arm in first but yeah let's have a look at the one i've already done this is the one i've already welded on um it welded okay but yeah i turned the settings quite high up and uh also when i was heating that up um i'll show you what i used so when I was doing it, I was using this to try and heat it up. Kind of want to heat it up to around 50 or 80 degrees I've been told to cast. So then I had this gun, so it's only at 13 degrees. Um, so when I go to heat it up, I want it around 50 or 80 before I start. So yeah, let's smash this out then. Okay, so <clears throat> this uh, Willwood caliper, this is actually off a uh, caterham, front brakes for a caterham I've been told. Um, all this stuff is from Northeast Brakes, he makes the brackets and everything. So this will pretty much go like that, so it's clear in the bolt there. Um, so yeah, we'll stick it all on and I can show you what the final thing is like. If you want a setup like this and you're in the Scotland area, you know, uh, hit up uh, Northeast Brakes. Can't fault this stuff. You know, he's really good price, really good brackets, fits perfect. So yeah, let's get it all bolted up. There she is, double calipers on, looking sexy. So yeah, big uh, thank you to Richard at Northeast Brakes. Uh, can't follow his work, it's really good. Um, I just gave him my hub uh, and then, yeah, then he just kept the hub for about a week max, I would have said, and made the brackets, put it all together, boom, done. So quite uh, painless, but now if I run 
semi-slicks or anything like that and they're nice and wide then that should lock the brakes no bother and also the other benefit to these is when you're on the foot brake and you try and pull the hydro it doesn't like lift the foot brake at the same time so it's just a total separate uh, plumbing uh, so yeah happy with that so see you guys next time uh, you can like and subscribe do all that stuff all helps the channel if you subscribe so yeah see you later Ready? Yeah.